Freilchem Pirim, Freilchem Pirim. So um, here we are. We're standing in the uh, in the center of of the pipeline, the center of the supply, the supply of what we received. Pnimis Atayre. We're in the supply line where our existence, our existence, our existence being is receiving an update an upgrade an upload of a new a new way of communication a new way of of being a new way of being able to understand presence the more present i am the less separation there is the more present i am starting from the stomach from the center from the is the more present i am the less friction the less the less separation there is. If you want to measure your levels of separation, try to be present and see how much resistance you have, where it, where it's coming in, how how hard it is to be present. So, the way to do this is once again is by drinking. That's how the masters of the people that wrote that brought down, downloaded this consciousness, or consciousness itself that manifested in Vel. Let's understand something, that since a Yid is something that is um, we're, we're a piece of the Creator. He's, we're literally an emanation of Him. Imagine fingers, just a, just a projection, a manifestation from the body. Every person... Every person shows up in physical the way he the way he manifests. He manifests the way he is. That's his being. You look this way because that's who you are. Your energy is looks this way. This is how it shows up. Teferes, Gavura, Netzach, Everybody has there and then combinations and so on and so forth. But we are the pnimi. We are the inside of it. We are the pulse of that thing that created everything. That or let's call it an organism. We're getting because it's Purim, so we're using every word just to trigger a malik the heck out. This is way bigger than an organism, but it's an organism. It's we don't understand what it is when it get to a level. But he created a system so we can because he wanted us to to be. He wanted to be in communication with something. He doesn't have to. He wanted to. He desired. It's one of his desires. So he had a thought. Bani b'chori Yisrael, the first thought, the only thought. So no other creation, no other um, creation, no other creature, no, no other living thing in Velt is pulsing on this level of consciousness. Think of a behemoth, think of a, a shore, think of a bull, the type of consciousness he has when he eats his grass. Where is his head? It's in the grass. The lion, fine, killing machine. But then there's something, there's something that can speak to. It's a consciousness. Imagine the intelligence it takes for something to speak. Wood can speak. You know, how many things can speak? Then you have the animals can roar, but he can't speak. Then there's something that can speak. It's a the turning machine of the end of everything. Where he said, die, he said enough of the spread. He stopped. And we are, mamala, we're able to grind create with our mouths i can ask you bring this do that and people do that that's all the whole the, the situation you are in right now every situation you're married with kids business whatever it is you created that with your ruha mamalala yes you were trapped in pare and amalek so you were you were mamalala in low frequency so you created low frequency but if you're going to start modeling, uh, talking, grinding high frequency, you're going to create high frequency. So no other creation in the world has this koyach. They can create also just not by choice, it's just the way it's manifesting the thing. But we are in a place, we are in we're in the keser, we're in the brain. We're in top, the pulse of the brain. That's where we're at. That's where our consciousness is coming from. It's a white, pure zakh light. Zaka, Lavaina. That's where we reside. That's where we are from. So when you speak, 
you speak, you better make sure your words count. Because you're creating, and when you're creating, nothing is going to happen. If you're creating something that's low frequency, nothing is going to happen. It's not a punishment. You're going to live with low frequency. So how do we bring awareness to something that is keser, something that you can't speak or understand? It's Elon but it's a higher consciousness. It has no expression. What we're expressing is low frequency. This is a way higher expression. Imagine something that with by thinking it created all of we're his thought. We're a projection of his thought. The whole everything you see is just a thought. This thought was created to create separation, to wake us up, to bring awareness to us, as it's called symptom as the, the we bring awareness. To us, our ego kicks in. I start looking at myself as a something. I need to fit in. I have to. I need to. And this was done by different abuse and challenges that you went through in life that touched your innocence, so you became aware and you ruined it. So Simpson Rishon is scooping out the water. Simpson Shane is tapping the cup, saying, hello, you're in existence. Now my ego starts growing. <clears throat> then comes... The the Tzimtzum Shlishi, there's many Tzimtzum, but three levels which now I am able to wake up to who I am and then I become aware of my ego. First, first we were just egos. You were acting from a place of unconsciousness. Now you're aware of your ego. You know your faults. You know that you get upset. You know that you get angry, that you're not fully loving and compassionate. You're not feeling, or you are fully loving, compassionate and feeling and communicating. Whatever, whatever it is that's bringing awareness and then from... This place, I'm waking up to my consciousness, and as I start toning, tuning in, I'm bringing an awareness to it, the ego tones down. Because I'm looking at it, and, and if I bring das to something, choshech has to disintegrate. Because when you start looking at something, you're activating your das, and that's higher conscience. So lower conscience must go. Just That's how, that's how a little oil pushes away a lot of darkness. Just like when something screams louder, the smaller thing gets scared. When the plane flies over too loud, it can, sh- it can uh, blow the windows out because it's a higher frequency. Okay, so now once I bring Dallas, my, e- my, my, Dallas, my ego starts t- tuning down. And as it tunes down, I find myself click back in my Kesha Shield film and I find myself with presence, with oneness. And then I'm able to feel that also in physical body. I can physically experience when I'm connected. I'm physically connected when I speak, and I'm physically connected when I'm present in a conversation because I'm realizing that I'm communicating with another consciousness. And if I tune in, if I raise my awareness, I will raise that awareness. And this is how we're turning up the heat. Now a mole comes in right here and he slices right in. It's like he starts questioning, he doesn't feel it, he questions it, he's scared of it, he brings all types of stories to it. That is a mali. Because how did you feel when you were in the conversation? How did that feel? Did that feel like one or a separation? You were one with a conversation, in a conversation, in a higher conscience, in Dvaravaya. And how does it feel when you go into doubt world? Doubt is already separation. It's separation, it brings, confu- it, it brings confusion, it raises confusion. So today is the day that once again there was a design with his Chachmi. He designed a, a game. He designed the spiel. He designed the consciousness in the dream. He downloaded They put in a, a drop. And this is a day that we get to wake up to the highest consciousness because a Malik challenges my Das. A Malik doesn't want wealth. He doesn't want anything. He comes in that when you're already surrendered and you're one, he just jumps in right there. We lose touch. It's not. It can become a spiritual thing and it becomes a, you know. Yeah, so so basically, today in Purim is where, because Amalek challenged us, so he challenged my Das, and from Das, we jump into Kesir. From Das, Das slingshots in us into Kesir, because above that, Das is in the Kesir Shield film, and Kesir is at the bottom of the head. So how do I get the Kesser? What is Kesser? What is Kesser? 
How do we act in Kesef? Das is Askashis. means that I'm one with it. I'm one with my spouse. I'm one with my children. I'm one in the moment. When I'm in one, then I'm connected. When I'm connected, I have no questions. And when I have no questions, I'm present. And that is... Okay, it's the beginning of Kesir. Kesir is Kechashech HaKoer. Kesir is a place where it's Choshech. Kesir is a place where it's Choshech because we have no expression for it. It's too high above us. We have no... In, in, in other words, if for Kesir to express in Vel, there has to be, you know, a lot of pain comes down with that. Because it's so intense, it's so high up that how else is... We need such bittle and such nothingness to be able to be a vessel for Kesir, to be aligned with that, that it looks like, um, like a holocaust. Because it's toy v'rak, you can't process it. But put him, we can get into Kesir. We are in Kesir right now. Because ultimately, what he wanted, because yes, it's dark and we have no language for it, but what he wanted to play out, what he had intention in that place that we have no language for and is behind, beyond the, the thing that writes the program is exactly what you're experiencing right now in color. We are in Malchus. And then it's going to be Malchus and Kesir, Panem, Bapanem, which means that we're going to be present in Malchus I'm going to be present in my day to day. I'm going to understand how far I've come and I'm going to understand what bad habits are. I'm going to know it. But yet, I'm going to be completely surrendered in the moment. That's when I'm going to be looking Kesser face to face upon him, upon him. That's happening today. That's happening right now. Drink and be besimcha. And it will take you into a place of Adaliyada where I don't need to understand the process. I am in the process. I am. I've become the process. I've become my thoughts. I create. I I demand, and I say that I want to, I want to tap into the light. I want to tap into the positivity. And when a molly comes, trigger you. Tap in more to that. Whatever you need to do, feel it in your in your gut. Feel it in your in your in your hearts and your minds. Feel the confidence. There's nothing to be afraid of. You know the squeeze. You know the drill. Yeah. Amalek came after Kriyas Yamsev. Shama Ami Gazen Chilachas Yoje Poloshes Oz Nevala Lif Adam Ela Moy of the Rzeim Erad Namoygi. They were. All the Midas, everybody was in place. Everybody was checked. They know exactly their place. And we, we saw clearly, so our egos were, sub, sub, they were, they were, they surrendered completely. Comes Amalek and he jumps in right there, right there, in the innocence comes and he starts bringing questions. He jumped into the hot water to show, nah, it's not so, it's not so terrible. Yeah. So, um, so basically, yeah, this is this is Purim, this is Kesser, and um,